division and also do the sales as well. Uh, today I'd like to talk with you about pruning back your perennials. Uh, perennials are one of my favorite things to plant at, because they give you such a, a beautiful show of color. Right now you can't really tell what this is. Uh, it's Mexican bush sage, also known as Salvia lucantha. Puts, puts on a uh, flower stalk about a foot uh, with purple and white flowers. It's a beautiful plant. Uh, when you plant it, it's gonna go in about maybe six inches and by the end of the growing season, this is what it'll be. Now, what we're gonna do today is we're gonna go ahead and cut this back. I'm gonna show you how to far, how far back to cut it. And you just get, get down in here on it and start cutting. All these stems are dried and dead and you're not gonna hurt anything by taking them back to the ground because when this thing comes out in the spring it's gonna put on a new flush of growth all this stuff is dead and it's only gonna hinder it so don't be afraid to get in here and really hack on it See, it doesn't take much to get in there and, and cut it back as far as it needs to go. It wouldn't hurt to leave a stem or two sticking up just so you know, you know where it's at and you don't walk on it. Uh, but from here, go ahead and apply your new spring mulch and get everything dressed up. Give you a good uh, clean look. It's easy to mulch when it's in here like this and you don't have to fight with the plant. But this is getting you ready for the spring and enjoy those perennials.